I built an automated nudge report creator. What the crap is a nudge report? Valid question. If you've ever read anything on behavioral economics, nudge is affectionately the name that's given to any unit or any body that impacts behavior using psychology and marketing basically. So a couple weeks ago, I showed you that I built this rag bot that has access to like 18 or 19 different books on consumer psychology, psychology and marketing, behavioral economics, etc. Well, I've connected that bot to a flow that generates a nudge report for your business. Essentially, it looks at your website, looks at things like your color scheme, it looks at your offer, it looks at your analytics, and then provides this robust report. Anyway, let me show it to you and you can tell me what you think. All right, here it is, but let's get a closer look. First, we need to upload some business critical information. And there's a lot here, but that's because if you want a good report, you gotta give the AI something to work with. So here, it asks you for a business overview, which you can provide by telling it, or you can give it the URL to your website. Then it asks to describe your target audience in detail, describe your current marketing strategies, input your sales history and conversion performance, which you can do through a file upload of like a Google Analytics export or a WooCommerce export, or you can just give it some stats through text. And then it asks for customer feedback. You can copy and paste some reviews if you have any, or if you want to upload a CSV file full of reviews, you can do that as well. Input main competitor. Uh, you can give it your competitor's website or uh, input text about that competitor. Then what are your business goals? What are your budget constraints? What are your tech capabilities? So basically your tech stack and how are decisions made in your organization? Anyway, that's the form. Now let's look at this beautiful flow. So first we take the information from the form and if you decide to put your website URL in there, it'll take a screenshot of the homepage, give it to Google Gemini and then provide a detailed description of your website. So basically this gives like the colors, the images and all the text on the page. Then it collects the data from your analytics, your conversion history, or website data. Then it takes your review information. Then it takes your competitor information. So if you give it a URL, it'll just scrape the text off of it. Then the API call goes to the RagBot, which exists on a different platform, and it gives all of the details that you just gave the form. So here's the prompt that the RagBot is given. Below is the business context needed for your report. It's already been system prompted to create a nudge report. It's target audience, current marketing strategies, sales and conversion metrics, competitor, customer feedback, budget constraints, all that information. And then the report is put into a PDF document and emailed to you. Now let's take a look at what that looks like. Here is my email, nudge report attached. And here we go. Nudge report for AI plus automation. It gives a consumer behavior analysis, a contextual factor analysis, so basically assessing the digital environment, marketing strategy recommendations, behavioral interventions. Uh, behavioral interventions are like changes that you can make to the environment. So in this case, this is designed for people with online businesses. So your environment, your selling environment is your website. So behavioral interventions are little things that you can tweak to coax um, desired behavior from your website visitors and buyers. Then some best practices, an implementation roadmap, and of course the KPIs that you should be tracking along the way. And that's a nudge report. Let me know if that's something that would be valuable to your business.